Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have uh, here to share with you Prisma Palette Summer Break Collection and this is a summer collection. I'm not sure if it's gonna uh, last, um, if it's just seasonal and it's not gonna be bring back um, through the year or it's just something that they launched this summer and when it's sold out it's gone. I have no idea. This is sold as a collection, as a set on their website and it's a set of eight eyeshadows and uh, their price uh, the price of the set is 87.60 and I've got the sample bags which is $15.60 plus free shipping and I believe I used the code uh, they had the sale I'm not sure if it was 4th of July or something like that around that time and yeah I'm late posting this because I'm having too much fun this summer <laughs> Uh, but yeah, I have here the little bags. Uh, they come like this in this little uh, plastic uh, zip up, zip pluck mini bags. And um, the samples, they are very tiny, I'll say. It's not a big sample bag. I wouldn't purchase this, you know, just, I don't know. I will purchase this just to try out the product before buying just to make sure I love the product uh, but yeah every time you order something from Prisma palette I got um, a sample and with my order I also got an extra sample so I like getting samples with my purchase but not necessarily buy the samples because they are so tiny so today I'm gonna share this tiny little collection and attempt a look a summer something fun makeup look and I'm also gonna include my little sample that uh, it came with. Um, and I'm also gonna link below, I had a, a swatch before that I did with their eyeshadows. They're really amazing and I'm gonna link it down below if you're interested in different kind of eyeshadow colors and their swatches. So I am gonna do my best to swatch this for you and then we're gonna create a makeup look. If you never heard of Prisma palette before, uh, they are creating mineral eyeshadows, no nasties in there, clean ingredients, and they used coconut oil or jojoba oil to press them, and they are very rich and smooth, and they deliver great eyeshadows, and I really love the, eye, the color range that they offer, they have mattes, they have shimmery, they have uh, dual chrome, I believe, they have... Um, few colors like that so they have like amazing amazing colors and I really love that they came out with this summer collection which is very very uh, trendy right now I love the colors that they included I really think that I could use any of these colors in the collection and um, I'm gonna try to use them in order that they put them on the website so we have banana split uh, which is a satin yellow Paradise, which is a metallic turquoise. We have Only You, which they say it's a satin pinkish red. We have poolside and I love this blue. This is like a slightly purplish blue. We have living coral, which is a bright orange. We have zip line, 
and this is a uh, bright green. We have Daiquiri and it's like a pink, metallic pink, very cool tone, almost lilac. And UV, which is a purple with an iridescent effect. And my sample that it came with my order is Shocking Magenta. Of course, shocking. So, I'm gonna try my best to create a look using some of this eyeshadow and we're gonna use some cool tones and some warm colors in here. So I'll definitely suggest priming your eyelids um, before you start. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna use the banana split uh, in the inner corner of my eye. gentle kind of press the color in so I get like a full color effect for a more intense effect you need to wet the brush let's try that actually and I'm using a rose water you can just use water but I'm using this Qatari rose water Let's see if it's going to be more intense. Because I like to have a really intense effect. And this is going to help it last longer. But you need to be careful not to blink. So you don't crease your color until it's drying. When you apply them wet. And I'm going to go in. corner of my eye too, just to highlight this and bottom. Oh, I just love this yellow. So beautiful. It's like a satin. I'm gonna continue with the living coral that I have here, which should be like bright. Oh no, let's use something in between. I'm gonna use the Daiquiri, which is the pink color. And I'm gonna transition from the yellow with the Daiquiri and then um, we're gonna use the living coral. And so I'm just going to use the same brush because I want to transition and I don't want Oh, this is beautiful okay. and I didn't wet it because I want to make sure I can blend it in but I can add a little more in the wear it and just use the wet brush in the center. Oh, this is so beautiful. Okay, just kind of blend. Mmm, what do you guys think? Okay. Now, let's see what we should do on the bottom. I'm gonna use the coral the living coral on the bottom of my eyes because my eye 
because I have this orange hair. It's gonna look amazing. I'm gonna wet the brush because I want such an intense orange on the bottom of my eye. And I'm telling you, the samples are so tiny can use maybe once or twice it's not a lot of color to be honest I'm gonna slightly drag it like I do with the wing eyeliner I can do like to do this I'm gonna do it like colorful kind of fill this gap Let's go blue. I'm gonna take another clean brush and I'm gonna use a smaller brush actually because I want to take this whole side and I want to kind of get some. Let's see between the full side and the purple or the blue. Hmm. I think I love the blue more. I am going to do actually a crease with it, so I'm not going to use a wet brush. I'm going to try to slightly crease on top of my pink. Let's see how that goes. I'm just you know, taking from the little bag. And I hope it's not going to make a mess now. Be a little bit precise I guess with this then I'm just gonna drag it out a little bit because I'm dying to use that green. I have here a green, right? Paradise. And I have a zip line, but I'm dying to use the zip line because it's so bright and beautiful. And I have here a stipple brush. And what I'm gonna do, I am gonna wear it. I'm gonna put it in a little bit of the rose water. get it into my color and believe me it's not a lot of color in this sample it's not I wish it was a little tinier more okay so what I'm gonna do I'm just gonna kind of mess it up with the green at the end I'm gonna blend some green just like so just to give it like more like a I don't know fun effect Almost like a glow, it's gonna get that green glow, but not too intense or too obvious, just slightly there. I have here a purple, and what we're gonna do with the purple, we're gonna do. I think I'm gonna do my waterline with it and I'm just gonna use a clean brush. Let's see, I feel a clean brush. Yeah. 
Uh, I'm not gonna wet it and I'm just gonna take slight powder. This is the UV and it is a very beautiful purple. Just lining my waterline. Hmm. And that's it. Now I'm gonna apply some mascara and I'll be right back. So this is my final look using the Prisma palette summer break collection please let me know what you guys think about these eyeshadows i think the pigmentation is really really awesome the colors are really amazing and i can't wait to try them individually too um yeah i i do believe i can't pick a favorite because i love them all for different reasons but the colors are really amazing and i'm gonna link it down below if you wanna purchase them you can get a 10 percent code uh, using my uh, discount if you don't use my direct link uh, if you like this video please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and if you want to see more please subscribe thanks for watching and i'll see you next time